All right, so I wanted to meet with you real quick and talk about this week's assignment. It's going to be an easy one, so don't worry. I know a lot of you have asked questions about where the assignment was, and I was just trying to pause and give a moment for everyone to um, get caught up, okay? So this week's assignment is going to be the first real introduction into your final project that will be due at the end of the semester. It's going to be worth 10% of your grade. So if you don't do it, um, gosh, your whole letter grade down, and it won't be a completion grade like a lot of the assignments that you've had so far where you just got 100 points for completing it. Um, it'll be graded. So make sure I'm trying to really drive the point home that this is where I really want you to dig in and put a really good quality product out. So I'm going to give you two examples of the projects that I'm expecting from you at the end of the semester. doesn't have to be these. If you come up with a different um, creative project that you want to do, then come and see me and we'll talk about that. So I'll give you two examples of something that you could try. One, you could do a video. Video must include drone footage and it must include an audio. So it's five minutes long at minimum. What I'm thinking of is that you're creating a movie trailer, you're creating a clip from a movie, you're creating a short story, you're creating a video that's ready, that's production ready, you're done, you're ready to give it as a deliverable to wherever it's gonna go, okay? That's what we're simulating here. I get it, there's a lot of technologies that maybe we've just barely brushed on, we've got to the end of the semester, we're gonna learn and go through um, many more of those. If you've already taken your multimedia class, part of your degree plan, then you should have a lot of the video editing and things already kind of touched base and already kind of learn and know. So um, use drone footage, use audio overlay. You can work in teams or individual, at least five minutes long. Now for another option, you may choose to do a commercial full commercial length, let's say you want to go, and I don't know what that is, two minutes, two and a half minutes. Um, I get that's a little bit long for a regular TV commercial, but I'm looking for a commercial that is, um, that's kind of been thought through, a well-processed advertisement, whether you want to go down to a car lot and have someone stand in front of a car lot and have a speech, and, I, and this is more than just a camera sitting in front of a drone hovering in the sky, sitting in front of someone while they're saying, hey, come down the car lot and buy some cars. This should be fading in and out or whatever kind of transition you want, transitions between different shots, different overlays, words across the screen. Uh, go watch a commercial, okay? Um, that's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for something that's with the technology that we have, with all the free programs that we have, I get it, we don't have the best studio equipment, but it's, it's really about learning the different multimedia disciplines, putting them together, and incorporating our drone image with that. That being said, there's many other things that you could do. Um, if you've got some create, creative thoughts that you wanna do something different, then the, the video clip, which could be, like I said, a trailer or a short story, or the commercial, let me know. So by Monday night at midnight, there'll be an assignment up at some point that says, here's what I'm looking for. And what I need is just you to tell me by Monday night whether you're going to work as an individual or you're going to work as a team. Now, if you work as an individual and you want to get your mom, dad, cousin, brother, sister, significant other, or someone else to stand in, be a part of your movie, perfectly okay. I need to know if you're going to be together. Well, we have a learner that's remote, right? So um, he's going to have to do it by himself. Um, that's just what it is, and he can get folks around him to help do that. And if you have any problems making that happen, just see me privately. We'll take care of you. The second part of that assignment that's going to be due Monday is to tell me what you think you're going to do. Let's spend some time. That's all you have to do is think. That's your assignment this week. It's just to think. Come up with a creative idea, what you think you're going to do. I'm going to do a short, spooky film in the um, wildlife reserve 
at RSU. Sounds like a great option. Whatever it is you come up with um, doesn't have to be the same thing that you end up doing. If you get started and you just can't get the creative moment there and you get another creative blast at something completely different, I'm okay with that. I just want to see that by Monday you've formed groups, if you're going to do it a group, and you've at least come up with an initial thought of, hey, this is what I think I want to do. All right? So that's the assignment. It's going to be due by Monday, and I will try to go ahead and release early next week's assignment. So if you decide to get a a head start on that, you can. But easy week. Give everybody an opportunity to get caught up. All you got to use is your brain for a few minutes to complete this week's assignment, and I'll get that posted um, before midnight tonight, or at least before you wake up tomorrow. All right, we'll talk to you later.